Thank you. Stomp. Okay. Well, I've been here 32 years and uh, for the Times Union, and I've been photographing the river 32 years. So uh, when you move to Jacksonville, it's, it's kind of hard to miss. You know, it, it's, it's there. It's everywhere. Uh, this is south of Jacksonville. It's called Marker 24. Uh, this is one that I shot from uh, County Dock, shot on the medium formerly known as film. Uh, I, we used to, to put stuff in a camera and we had to process it. And, uh, and it took a while before you saw your image. But, uh, but, uh, and, and this is another film image that was uh, taken uh, at uh, Rodman Reservoir. And uh, this is pelicans flying. And this was shot from a helicopter, which is actually a pretty good platform to take pictures from. Uh, it's back in the day when, when we could uh, hire helicopters. Uh, now this was taken uh, from a helicopter also. This was a story we did on the St. John's River where uh, Roger Bull, or a writer at the Times Union, and I spent an entire month uh, photographing and doing stories on the river. Uh, this is another aerial, I think maybe from an airplane. Uh, the fog is lifting, boat, Beauclair Point uh, kind of made a, 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 nice, uh, a nice image. And I don't think this picture ever made the paper. I don't know why. So uh, this is uh, a little swamp that is near my house. It's about a half a mile from my house. Uh, it is Goodby's Creek. And... Uh, I kind of stole this angle from my son, my youngest son, who I was photographing the stream, and I looked over and he had his cell phone camera pointing up the tree, so I borrowed his angle there. Uh, this is on the St. John's River, uh, south of Green Cove Springs. I'd been wading around in the water for a while, and then I found these gator tracks. Uh, so <laughs> l luckily, he, he had been gone a while. So. This is uh, the result of a fishing trip, uh, I, uh, uh, and, and he was doing a lot better than we were as far as catching fish, but uh, it, it's, the, the, it's just a lot of luck involved here. It, uh, I was able to, to get him in focus, which that's the main thing. This is the St. John's River uh, down in Central Florida, uh, where there is not much more than palm trees, mosquitoes, and cows. Uh, so, but it's, it's beautiful down there. It's very serene. Uh, not a lot of people. This is uh, the same area. This is around the Lemon Bluff area, which is uh, Oviedo. Oviedo. Uh, it, it's uh, a really, really prehistoric looking place. Uh, so it's, uh, it's one of those areas that if, if you weren't going there, you probably would never see it, you know. Uh, usually I would put the boat in at about the same time the gator hunters were taking their boats out and vice versa in the evening when I was coming in, the gator hunters were going out. So uh, now this is the Econlock Hatchie River, which is a tributary of the St. John's. And I had heard that this is where they filmed part of the movie Dinosaurs, and you can see why. Uh, this is one of the areas uh, Roger Bull and I went. Uh, there was one day when, we, when I pulled out to take a picture, walked down to, to get the picture, and came running back to the boat. And Roger thought I was being chased by a bear, but it was a cloud of mosquitoes. So <laughs> we were able to get in the boat and get away from them without too much damage. Uh, this is the St. John's uh, south of Green Cove. This is uh, Julington Creek, uh, the swamp at Julington Creek. This is the uh, Julington Durban Peninsula, the, the park. So it's a, a good little hike down into here, but you can see tremendous cypress trees like this uh, in there. It's a really nice place. Uh, this is a little different from what I usually do. It, it's uh, reflections from Julington Creek. Uh, 
it was in the winter, so there were no leaves on the trees. So I started playing around with the camera, and this is actually upside down from the way you would view it. But I think it makes a better picture that way. Uh, this is uh, Fort George Inlet, the uh, Alamakani boat ramp, which is a little park. And uh, around the corner there is where Kingsley Plantation is. So there's a lot of history right here. Uh, this is one of my absolute favorite places to go. It's Round Marsh in the Theodore Roosevelt area of the Temequan. Uh, this is from the platform. A lot of, you, a lot of folks know about this, but uh, it's always different every time you go there. This is sunrise, uh, and it's a sunrise kind of place, so you need to get there early. Uh, like I said, it's hard to miss when you move to Jacksonville. Uh, it uh, makes for a beautiful photograph and uh, dusk is, is the, my favorite time to photograph it because you get all these reflections and uh, colors in the water. This was from County Dock also. This was uh, at the end of the day when uh, I got here late uh, and uh, when I got on the dock, fishermen were yelling, you're late. An hour ago there were 10 photographers here. <laughs> But I, I was able to, to catch a couple of, a couple of sn uh, snippets of lightning. 